it's pretty well documented now the long-term problems retired NFL players have been experiencing as a result of repeated concussions. But there is a concern here in Utah about young athletes and concussions. Mary Nichols has more in tonight's Check Your Health report. Yeah, I didn't pass out or anything, but I can't remember what happened before it. Last April, 10-year-old Amelia was playing in a soccer game when a soccer ball hit her in the head. I got back up and I walked off the field and asked for a sub, and I didn't come back in. Though she never lost consciousness, Amelia did have a headache and her vision was blurry. Her doctor suspected Amelia had a concussion. What parents need to be looking at, I think, is really, is my child acting the way they would normally act? Dr. Annette Russo is a neuropsychologist here at the Tosh Sports Concussion Clinic in Murray. She says Utah has strict protocol for young athletes hurt on the playing field. So if, you, if your child is injured on the field, they are to be pulled off be medically evaluated and be fully symptom free before they go through what's either called the graduated return to play or the return to play protocol. The protocol was put into law in 2011. Still, Dr. Russo says, parents and coaches need to work with young athletes who may want to keep playing. The struggle is to really help them understand that if you take the time now, you're going to miss less games, less practice, and you're going to get back into your life so much more quickly. In Amelia's case, her concussion will keep her on the sidelines for a year to a year and a half. And she still has symptoms of the concussion, though she says she's getting better. I don't see double anymore. I did see double, but that's gone away. And... I don't feel like I'm going to throw up anytime soon. Experts say recovering from a concussion takes time. Oftentimes, a young athlete will need weeks, sometimes months of therapy and rest before they can return to the playing field. And the potential for long-term problems is going to be there. So we really try to emphasize that, yes, you may be giving us, it's going to be a rough few weeks, but that's a lot better than an entire season. Mary Nichols for Check Your Health. Experts at Tosh can also perform what's called an impact test. If you suspect that your child has suffered a concussion, for more information, you can go to KUTV.com and then click on the Check Your Health link.